Visual Studio Code, a free and open source program for editing code. Software is just a collection of text files organized in a precise way. VS Code provides an integrated development environment to help you edit, analyze, and manage these files efficiently. It's a Microsoft project that first appeared in 2015 as a lightweight cross-platform code editor that ships a new update every single month. Today, it's the world's most popular code editor. Download it, then use it to open a folder that contains your application files. Before you can write high-quality code, you'll need to make the editor look cool by clicking the settings icon to update your syntax and icon themes. Next, you'll notice the file explorer contains all the files in this directory. Open a file and notice how the text inside is colored. That's because VS Code analyzes the symbols inside the file to perform syntax highlighting. It will automatically detect problems in your code. If a variable is not used, it becomes a little more opaque. A red squiggly line appears if your code will not compile. Hover over it for more details. It also creates an outline of the code structure to quickly navigate to the line of code that you're looking for. Now, as you start writing some code in this file, you'll notice a little box pops up as you type. Professional developers rarely type every character. Instead, they leverage VS Code's IntelliSense to autocomplete the code that they were thinking about writing. When the right suggestion comes up, hit Tab or Enter to complete it. You might also right-click on your code to find a variety of options to analyze and refactor it. But almost anything you can do with the mouse, you can do faster with the keyboard. Hit Control shift papa to bring up the command palette. From here, you can quickly access any VS Code command or any file in your project. Let's use it to open up a terminal session, which brings up the command line here at the bottom. We can use it to run commands in this project, like git init to enable source control. Or better yet, we can click on the source control icon to run git commands with a visual interface. VS Code is minimal by design, but as an open source JavaScript project, it's easily extendable. From the extensions panel, you'll find a huge number of packages that provide specialized tooling for whatever framework or language you're working with. Most software projects work with the cloud in some capacity. The remote button can connect your editor to a remote GitHub repository, Docker container, or cloud server. And you can even run VS Code itself in the cloud to access it from the browser on any machine. This has been VS Code in 100 seconds. Hit the like button and subscribe if you want to see more short videos like this. And if you really want to maximize your productivity as a developer, I just released a brand new VS Code Magic Tricks course that contains a ton of productivity hacks for beginners and advanced developers alike. The first 10 videos are free, so check it out on Fireship.io. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.